now, forewarn weather with cutting edge technology for the most up to the minute forecast in Southeast Michigan. Good Sunday morning, everyone. What a difference a day makes. Yesterday, extremely windy conditions. It's still going to be breezy today, but we've got sunshine into the forecast as we head throughout your Sunday. Tower cam over downtown Detroit. We've kept a little bit of high cloud cover in overnight last night and early this morning after those extremely strong wind gusts yesterday. We topped out at 66 miles an hour over in Adrian, 63 miles an hour in Auburn, 61 miles an hour at Metro Airport, and that was just before 10 o'clock last night, and 60 miles an hour working into Monroe. Nowhere near this as we head throughout today. Just a colder start for everyone heading out the door. From this time yesterday morning, we're running about 10 to upwards of 20 degrees colder, but we're still going to warm things up well above average as we head into this afternoon. Our first cold front from yesterday, well off to the east from Toronto, working down to the west of Pittsburgh and heading toward Nashville. We've got another cold front that's going to move through tomorrow. This morning to the west of Minneapolis, to the south of Rapid City, South Dakota. This will move through Metro Detroit as a dry cold front tomorrow. No rain expected with it, but a drop in temperatures for the next couple of days. We're into the 50s on Monday and Tuesday, then a drastic warm up back into the upper 60s by Thursday, and then temperatures are going to take another nosedive. 50s by the end of the week, then 40s by the time we get to Saturday, and it looks like those below average temperatures will be sticking around into the middle of the month as well. The Climate Prediction Center's 6 to 10 day temperature outlook November 11 through 15 keeps below average temperatures in play for most most of the lower 48 states, but here in Metro Detroit, that means we could see a little wintry weather by the time we get to the weekend. Clouds increase Thursday night into Friday morning. We will bring rain showers scattered into the forecast by the time we get to Friday afternoon into Friday evening. Now heading into Saturday, the models are in no sense of agreement on timing as of right now. They are in agreement about the wintry variety showing up into the forecast in the terms of rain and snow showers, just because we get some colder air moving in at the upper levels of the atmosphere. So I agree with what clouds and radar are showing, but I don't agree with the timing as of yet. This is seven days out, so we'll continue to finite that forecast over the next couple days. Mid 60s this afternoon, lots of sunshine above average yet again. Same for the Lions game, that one o'clock kickoff over at Ford Field, upper 50s by early this afternoon, and also looking good for Election Day, mid 50s by the time we get to Tuesday afternoon. We warm things back up into the 60s for Wednesday and Thursday before the rain showers move in on Friday and the rain snow shower mix moves in for the first half of next weekend.